While the winter months are easily the time we are most likely to get the flu, flu season is a bit of a misnomer. While flu cases do increase by 10 times or more during these months, the virus can still be transmitted at any time of the year. So what causes the massive increase while it's cold outside? Influenza will typically spread around the world in yearly outbreaks. In both the northern and southern hemisphere, the outbreaks tend to be in the winter months. So for the United States, the flu season is considered October through May. The Centers for Disease Control and Prevention puts out information every year. And as you can see from this chart, February is usually the peak of flu season. However, in the Southern Hemisphere, it is the opposite, with flu season usually running from May to October with its peak being in August. There are many theories to why we have a flu season. First, people are indoors more during the winter and are thus spending more time in close proximity with one another, making person-to-person -person transmission much more likely. Second, the cold means drier air, which may dehydrate our mucous membranes, making our bodies less effective at defending against viruses. But my favorite from the research is that many countries do not have school during the summer months, but once school is back into session, the virus spreads from the germy hands of kids. And while we don't have one reason that fully explains why the flu is so prevalent in the winter, one thing is certain. If you are able to, get the flu shot. Seriously, the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention, the CDC, which we already talked about, and the World Health Organization both recommend that nearly all people over the age of six months old should receive a flu shot. The flu shot is the best way to protect yourself and your loved ones during the flu season. Also, wash your hands a lot. Like, for real. Whatever you're doing now, wash your hands more. So stay safe and stay healthy this winter. And that's it for this episode. Hopefully I shed some light on why the flu is seasonal. And hopefully I inspired you to get a flu shot. Let me know in the comments if you've already gotten your shot or if you plan to. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Share this with your friends. Spread the love about the flu shot. And we'll see you in the next episode.